Yo, what is going on guys? It's Shine here, bringing you another video. I hope you like that new intro I made. I freaking, I love it, personally. But make sure to leave a comment about whether you like it or not. But we're doing a Q&A. So thank you so much for all the questions. I really didn't expect all the questions I got, so thank you very much for the, the questions on that video. Let's get right into it. Number one, we have Rezzy. If you could go anywhere, where would you go? I'd probably go to some place like Dubai or something nice like that, like Spain, because they're just really nice countries and everything there is so much more advanced than here in the UK, like the cars and the houses and everything. And honestly, Dubai just looks amazing. And I'd probably also go to space, because who wouldn't want to go to space? So next, we have another question from Rezzy. Thank you for both of those questions right here. Would you ever consider quitting YouTube? Now, I answered that in the last uh, Q&A, but I'll, I'll answer it again in this one. Definitely, it, it's a consideration that every YouTuber makes, depending on like the situation of everything, like how it's going, um, how busy they are in their daily life, and, and just uh, different factors like that. But I definitely have considered it before, but I just think like, if I do it because I enjoy it, then hopefully the hard work that I put in will one day pay off. So um, at the moment, I'm obviously not going to quit, but I have considered it. Next, we have an amazing question from Pova, and he put, when are you going to hit 1,000? You deserve it. Thank you so much. That honestly, that means so much to a YouTuber to hear that. And I really want to hit um, 1,000 this year. So make it happen, guys, and hopefully, we can hit a thousand this year. Next, we have one from Jabby Torres. Thank you so much. I mean, I can just tell by your name that you're an amazing guy and probably Indian as well. I just, I'm just getting that vibe. But you asked, Swag One Famalam, what is your favorite type of video to make? <laughs> Bro, oh, shout out to you, Deb. Um, my favorite type of video to make is the Shine Inspiration Wheel. Or any of the games I make, like Guess That Trick Shot or What Happens Next, just because they take a lot more effort, and I know that I've I've put in a lot more like effort into the video to make it better for you guys. So I, I love making every video I make. Obviously, I, I choose to make the videos based on how well I I enjoy making them, but preferably the games I make. Next, we have another amazing question from Shivy, and he asks, "How did you become a good drawer?" and I want to be as good as you. Honestly, thank you so much. That means a lot, man. I appreciate that so much. I just pretty much practiced. I used to be terrible at drawing. I would hate art at school, but pretty much I just realized like, um, just draw the things you, you like and always have a reference image because you, wanna, you want something to look like the actual object. So if you have a reference image, it really helps trying to get that the, the drawing as perfect as possible and just practice loads obviously just do little doodles and that and you'll just get better naturally but thanks again for that question and I hope to see some of your art in the future the next question is from Charles he says what is my favorite food I don't really have a favorite but since they're here these are so good I they are Anyways, I don't really have a favourite food. On to the next question. We have got a question from Ben Milner. Thank you very much for the question. He asks, you know, something really simple. Um, what is 663,788 times 685? Now, uh, this won't take too long. Let me just get my whiteboard. Alright, so pretty uh, self-explanatory. <laughs> Let's go a 6 there, a 6 there. Three, seven, eight, eight. We want to draw lines down each of them. Six and a half hours later. Six, eight, five down this side. Three weeks later. Diagonal lines. Are you keeping up? And then, um, you write the answer in the middle. Uh, not, I'm not sure if you can see that or not.
Thanks for the question, Ben. Okay, so my next question is from Sentry. Thank you for the question. What was your first ever console and when did I get it? My first ever console was probably a PlayStation 2 or 3 or maybe even a 1. I'm not sure, but I got it like years and years ago, probably in the, the 2000, under 2010, definitely. The most um, recent one that I can remember that's still pretty uh, early on is the 360 I got and that was about 2010, 11 maybe. So yeah, make sure to let me know when you got your first console. My next question from um, uh, na Naked tr uh, Trigger Trigger uh, do d Donut Feed Goggles Tennessee Donut Needle That's the one uh, Donut Needle Goggles Tennessee Um yeah, yeah, thanks for the question, bro. And the next question is from Daz. Am I awesome? Personally, uh, thank you. Yeah, yeah, I guess I am. I'm only joking. You're the man, Daz. Ben, back with another question. He asks, what is my best dance move? And, you know, while my hand's here, I guess you can... I get brought in land. Next question. All right, this is the big one. How many bottle flips can I do in a row? I guess I need a bottle for that. And maybe another squashy. They're, they're really nice. Oh my god. Two joined together. Let's have a look how many we can do then. Alright, here we go. Frick. There's the one. There's two. What? One. Oh my god. This ain't good at all. Basically what I've took from this is that I can get about one or two, which is great. One more. I get brought oh, in the land. Alright, not that that means anything at all. That's been the q and I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to smash a like if you enjoyed this video. Leave a comment as always and subscribe to join Shine Nation. Again, I hope you enjoyed my new intro. And honestly, I think if you want to purchase one of those, DM me on Twitter and I'll be happy to make you. And yeah, peace out guys.